Hey guys, so today we're gonna add some color to the boring black and white terminal that you've always seen for many many years. So what you gotta do is do the usual npm init dash y instead of an empty directory and type what I type on the screen right now. And here you will see what you're gonna see. So after installing all these dependencies, which I'll be leaving to a link in the description below, give an attribute type as module instead of your package.json and open a new index.js file and this is something called uh, like a shebang so just give it that so this is basically pointing it to the node uh, runtime in that is in installed inside of um, your computer and yes so here I'm just running you through all the imports that are required chalk inquirer and chalk animation these three are uh, what we'll be covering in this video so if you just do a simple console.log like this chalk.bg grid will give you a green color in the terminal okay so let's quickly write a function uh, an async function by the way and call it go crazy you know I didn't get any other name at this point of time so what go crazy does is go crazy will have a const text equals to chalk animation dot rainbow and inside let's say hmm, what will I say please subscribe to my channel so that's what I'm saying instead of chalk animation and let's define a const sleep and this will have uh, 2000 uh, milliseconds of delay and we will say it will be a new promise of set timeout equals to that much milliseconds okay so and then we will say await sleep let's do text dot stop and then let's console log something hmm. let's open template literals so this is uh, uh, template literal literally allows you to define uh, point of variables and use variables and methods instead of a string which is really handy it's a good feature of ES6. Okay. Did you hit subscribe? <laughs> now let's say if you don't subscribe, hmm, what will I say if you don't subscribe? Let me think. You will be. Open template total string chalk dot bg red and instead of that let's say terminated ha 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 so if you don't subscribe you will be terminated that's what I'm saying and let's await go crazy and let's go to still and run it and you'll see a rainbow colored animated text and if you don't subscribe you will be terminated so a lot of colors on your terminal and let's uh, so I have written another method called ask name which has some parameters like name type and message so this is basically taking an input from the user and displaying the relevant result so you might have seen this while installing packages while installing uh, create react app where the app asks you uh, some options like what will be your project name etc etc so here's how we can do it uh, creative uh, creating a colorful interactive CLI so let's just say uh, if the default choice is equal to n we will console log let's copy the above so i don't have to type it again and paste it over here and let's delete this delete this you are terminated so basically if the user says he did not subscribe then you are terminated and else we're not gonna check specifically for why for the context of this video we will say if 
the choice is anything other than n let's see let's copy paste chalk dot bg green u r hmm. let's take that text and paste it inside thank you for subscribing and let's run it on the terminal let's see what we have and here we have yep that's how you color your terminal thank you for watching i'll see you guys in the next one peace